Okay, thank you for your patience getting this going. Um, we're going to be talking about the five core supplements tonight. Um, when I got started with Young Living, I just kind of started with a few oils. And um, as I got more into it, I started to see the benefit of the supplements that they, they um, offered. And the more research I did, the more impressed I was because, and I'm going to, I'm going to go into this more, much more in depth, but, um, it's amazing how much research they have done in order to really focus in on the bioavailability of the supplement. Um, lots of supplements claim that, you know, they have all this stuff in it, but if it cannot get into your system and stay there, if it goes straight out or the body can't absorb it whatever it is, it, or if it's, if it's dissolving too early and not getting in the right spot, um, all those things, it's not effective. And so you can put anything you want into your body, but if it does not get absorbed, it's not doing any good. So that's what I really, really love about these supplements. I'm going to explain why they, um, are so good with their bioavailability. Um, and, but I want to stop back, stop and talk a little bit about why, you know, what do we even need supplements to begin with? I think back in, you know, my dad's day when he was younger or my grandfather's day, they had much more nutrient dense food. Um, so the farmer would go out and they would pick the lettuce and they would bring it to the store and you had nutrient dense produce right there that you could go and, and eat. And you've got tons of nutrition from those. Well, now, and it depends, I think on where you live. If you're, if you're, uh, you have your own garden and you're fertilizing it with good organic material and you're not putting a bunch of pesticides and herbicides on there, then you probably have a little bit higher density of nutrition in there. But if you're getting it from the store and it's especially if it's not organic and I don't always buy organic food, it just kind of depends on what's on sale and what I can get at times. Um, you are buying something that is not very nutrient dense because the farmers are going in and planting their crops they're putting a bunch of pesticides and fertilizers on it. They're taking the crop out and they're replanting just, you know, they're replanting so many things in such a short amount of time. And the um, modifications that they're making genetically with food these days are making it harder for our body to digest. So number one, we're not getting as many nutrients as we were back in the day when they were using these native fields and, you know, um, and there's, there wasn't as much fertilizer and pesticides on it. So not as many chemicals and they weren't genetically modified to be something that our body has a hard time ingesting. So all of those things play into the way that our body absorbs nutrition nowadays. Okay. So my dad probably did get better nutrition from what he ate than I am just because of what's available at the store right now. Um, Plus nowadays they are packing way, way, way more sugar processed foods. Mom, you've noticed that from our little no sugar stints, how they sneak that stinking little ingredient into everything. Tomato sauce. They don't need sugar and tomato sauce. You can just have tomatoes in there or, you know, sweeten it with some dates or something. You don't need to pack it into every little ingredient. And that sugar is wreaking havoc on our bodies. Okay. So we've got sugar, we've got the fertilizers, the pesticides, the the genetically modified food, the uh, nutrient, the lack of nutrients in our food all play into how we are not getting nutrition in our bodies from what we eat. Now, add that to the fact that we don't eat very good diets as Americans, do we? I mean, I think back in the day you were a farmer and you went out or a rancher still, you know, in our area, we have lots of ranchers. They go out and they sweat their butts off all day long, you know, and they, need some of those carbs and stuff that they get from the food that they have. But a lot of Americans don't have super active jobs and they're coming home and they're eating all these carbs. They have lots of sugar in the processed food that they're eating. They are not having healthy balanced diets. Okay. We're supposed to have like two thirds of our plate is supposed to be vegetables and fruits. And we are loading it up with potatoes and bread and things that turn into sugar. Okay. So we're just not doing a good job of getting nutrition into our bodies at all. So do we need supplementation? Absolutely. Okay. We need to get that nutrition into our bodies that we just aren't able to get in otherwise. 
does that still mean you need to probably focus on trying to eat healthy? Absolutely. We try to find we read labels. We try to take the sugar off, take a, you know, try and avoid sugar, excess sugar in our diets or hidden sugars in our diets. We try to have that two thirds rule on our plates, you know, to have a lot more um, vegetables and fruits um, to balance out what we have with the carbs. Um, but we still need to have that supplement. So I'm going to talk about five different supplements that I really think people should be trying to get into their system. Um, some are going to be more important for some people. I'm not saying you necessarily have to be taking all five of these. I personally am just trying to kind of get onto the, the multivitamin that I'm going to talk about. I haven't been real good about getting onto that yet. Um, but if you are taking various supplements that kind of replace one multivitamin, then you, you know, the multivitamin can replace those, or you can be taking the singles that kind of add up to the multivitamin, but our, our multivitamin is extremely, uh, diverse and complete. So that I'm going to talk a lot about that. Um, so just again, before we get into those five core supplements, I want to talk about the difference in going to Walmart versus the difference in getting it from Young Living. Why do our supplements work better than something you can get in Walmart? Um, a bioavailability bio is something I mentioned. I'm gonna go into that a little bit more here. So that's basically the job that your body is doing, absorbing the supplements. Um, and one of the reasons that our supplements are so good at that bioavailability is because a lot of it contains pure essential oil oils, okay? We have the highest quality essential oils out there. Um, we, um, and it, I'm gonna give you some stats here. With some studies that they did, they showed that without oils, your general supplement that you would see, I, it's not, it didn't say a Walmart supplement, it didn't say a, what, I don't even know what those, good earth or whatever supplements that you can get. Um, it doesn't say what brand, but compared to kind of your, your basic supplement that you can get from the store without oils, you're going to get about 42% blood absorption of those minerals and vitamins in 24 hours. Okay. 42% blood absorption in 24 hours with the oils. If you add the oils into these supplements, you're looking at 86% blood absorption in one hour, okay? You're talking double the amount of absorption in one hour that you would get in 24 of the other guys, okay? And that's what our essential oils are. I don't know, and Michaela, maybe correct me if you know of someone, but I don't know another company that has essential oils in their supplements. Do you? Do we have it? Is there any other company that puts essential oils in their supplements? I, I mean, doTERRA might have some supplements. I don't know what they that's have. That's what I was gonna say. I don't know if doTERRA does, but other than that, I don't think so. And we have many, many, many supplements. doTERRA might have a few. I'm not saying they're bad or anything, but we have, we have a, a better variety. Okay. Um, they've been doing it longer than living has. Yes. Yep. We're 25 years, 26, 27. Is it this year? 27. 27. Okay. 27. So uh, 28 this year. <laughs> um, now young living does, um, they also have the very highest quality ingredients. They really, really strive for high quality ingredients. And when you have high quality ingredients and you have scientists that are researching how the body best is able to get those vitamins and minerals into your body, you're going to have better absorption too. So not just the essential oils, but just the fact that we have amazing, amazing ingredients. Um, they do categorize their supplements into different colors. Now I wonder, has that changed because master formula is green and this is putting it under blue. Do you know anything about that? Michaela? Well, I know that it changed, but that's about all I know. Okay. Cause I know like <clears throat> the, I think they consider the inner defense to be green now. And that used to be in a blue I think it just has to do with if it's like an overall versus a um, very specialized, quote unquote, like 
the red ones are going to be like for your targeted. eyes. They're your targeted. Heart. Yep. Right. That's the word. And the green said it was for cleansing, but I think they've switched blue and green around because the green, I think now must be for foundational from what I'm looking at here. Right. Well, super B is green. So probably. Okay. That's not so, cleansing. That's foundational. Exactly. So you're, so let's just reword that a little bit here. So the green is, if you see a green label and I'm going to talk about these a little, I don't know if you can see the glare on that or not get the glare. There we go. Maybe life nine. This is a green label. So this is going to be a foundational foundational supplement. I didn't bring any blue ones over here, but if you see one red, this is sulfurzyme. This is kind of a, this is, this is not one of the five core ones, but it's like one of my top ones. So I had to include it today, but it's red. So it's going to be targeted. It's for something specific. Okay. And the blue ones are more for the cleansing. So that's going to be your ICP or your comfort tone are the ones that help kind of move that digestion through. Okay. Um, so they do label them so that you can kind of see um, what, what, the, what different category they fit in. So the green ones, building blocks, think building blocks, uh, vitamins, probiotics, minerals, omega-3s, um, the blue labels, cleansing. So gut health, gastrointestinal tract, bulking up the stool, supporting the muscles that propel the stool out of the body, absorbing toxins, cleansing the liver and intestines. Okay, all of that. And then the red labels are your targeted nutrition, your sulfurzyme, essential lime I'm gonna talk about tonight, power jize, pure protein, complete, targeted, specific um, systems or purpose. Okay. Um, so let's just kind of get into those core supplements. Do so you have any questions so far as far as why we take supplements, why Young Living is the one to go? <laughs> okay. I mean, and I do want to mention like Walmart, you just don't know what you're getting. Like they, they have, um, they have added stuff in there and you, you don't know what all they're putting in that bottle. I mean, and they, they put it on the label, but I don't know what that stuff means, but I can go and look what's in life nine. And I, I can ask exactly what those ingredients are and find out. And I know that they're all legit. Like they're good. They're all going to be good for me. There's nothing in this bottle. That's not going to be good for me. Um, I mean, aside from like an allergy or something, you have to watch for that. Okay. So master formula is the first one I'm going to talk about. Now I am using Jen O'Sullivan. If you go to YouTube and look up Jen O'Sullivan supplement speed dating, she has, I don't remember how many videos there's like 60 videos, I think. And they're all range from like three to 10 minutes long. And they talk about each and they, each one covers one of our supplements. And she is fantastic because she says, these are the ingredients that are in the supplement. Um, this is how you take the supplement. These are considerations when taking the supplement. This might be an allergy thing to watch for. So she kind of just covers, she does not like, and she'll tell you what it might help. Okay. So just a really overall good little mini review. It doesn't have to, it doesn't take long. Um, and she's basically going off of this supplement guide. I love this book. So if there's anything you, you know, specifically want to see more in depth, I could print you off a couple pages from this. Um, cause this thing is solid gold. It has all the stuff in it. It tells you what every single ingredient does, you know, and what, what the overall use of it is what you, you know, different considerations. So it's basically her supplement speed dating on steroids. There's four pages for master formula Four. Page dating on steroids. <laughs> uh, she has, she has her third edition coming out this month. I saw. I think it did. It did come out. Yep. Is it no, out? It is out as of like last week. I've been watching awesome. some stuff. I'm not sure which edition this is. Second edition. Why the second edition? One is it second? Yeah. Awesome. Um. Okay. So, master formula. Mom's been taking this one. I can find it. Okay. So here is what the packet looks like. There is a liquid vitamin cap capsule 
two micronized nutrient capsules and a phyto caplet in here. Okay. And this comes in, a, I got to show you this. This is pretty sweet. It comes in a box like this. And this box is good. Let me see if I can turn down a light so it's not glaring so bad here. Not better. Not really. Not really. I don't know. You can't get the glare off, but um, I tried. Anyway, this box. This is a month's supply. And this is the front of it. And then you take the back here and you pop it down. And these handy little packets pop out of here. And that's your dose for the day. Mom takes yours in the morning, right? Mm -hmm. With the breakfast. Yep. And you just have these four little capsules or caplets. Um, and you tear it open and you take it with your breakfast or before your breakfast. Okay. So there's 30 of these packets in here. And it's super easy for on the go or whatever. Okay. And it does tell you what the different caplets or capsules are on the back. So you kind of know what you're taking. Now there's not a ton of information on this box. So like I said, if you want more information on it, I can get it for you. Um, but the liquid, the liquid vitamin capsule. Okay guys, so this, this is one of our most popular supplements because it basically is an all in one. This thing is loaded with good stuff. It is very diverse. It has tons of your minerals, your vitamins, your whole complete vitamin B complex, which I'm pretty sure is hard to find in the supplement. I don't think that they have really good complete vitamin B complexes out there unless you're bu buying a specific vitamin B complex. Um, it has vitamin D3 and a lot of vitamin D3s are made from animal and not from plant. And the plant's easier for our, our body to digest, I believe is the way they explained it. This is from plants, so it's easier to digest. It's got prebiotics in it. Now, for anyone who doesn't know what a prebiotic, it's basically food for your probiotics or food for your good bacteria, sorry, food for your good bacteria in your stomach. So um, a lot of times it's like the, I don't know how to explain it, something that's a husk of a, I don't even know if I can say it right. So it, maybe it won't, but it's something made from a plant that helps feed the good bacteria in your stomach. So you can have prebiotics, you can have probiotics. Probiotics are extra good bacteria. This is a prebiotic. Um, they have tons, of, it has tons of antioxidants, which are great for glowing skin and hair. It has 60% of your daily iron, which is a really good amount. Um, it still wants you to have some iron that you're getting from food every day. So it's not gonna have 100% of your iron. If you have too much iron in a day, you start getting constipated. So it's not overdoing it, but it's getting a good percentage of your iron in a day. Um, it has vitamin K. Some supplements do not include vitamin K and vitamin K is absolutely essential for making sure that that calcium gets into your bones, making good bones and heart health. And um, if your supplements do not have vitamin K and they have a ton of calcium and vitamin D, it's not going to do the job right. Vitamin K needs to be in there and it has to be vitamin K2. Some people will give, doctors will give you a K3. K3 is not good for you, you need K2, just so you know. Um, it also has capsules full of vitamins or herbs and veggies. And what they do is they pick these herbs and veggies at the peak of their season or the peak of their life. Okay, so they have, that's when they're most nutrient dense and then they juice them and then dry that juice and pack it into a capsule. So you've got like this nutrient dense awesomeness that is packed into a capsule that has extra vitamins and minerals and bonus things that you'd find in plants stuck into this capsule that will help you with different things, which I will get to in a minute. I just think that's really awesome that you're getting, I mean, a, I know Juice Plus, I am kind of a fan of Juice Plus. They make their vitamins and stuff. They do similar process where they just pack a bunch of um, uh, I don't know if it's dry, juiced and dried or how they do it, but they basically take a bunch of vitamin, um, vegetable and fruit 
juice or something and pack it into these supplements. So, I mean, it's a really great idea because that's what we're missing from our diet, right guys? We're, we're missing vitamins and minerals that we're not getting from a good diet. Okay. Whether it's because our diet is compromised or because we're not getting that kind of nutrition with the what's on our plate. Okay. So, um, the micronized nutrient capsule, the liquid, I'm sorry, the liquid one, the liquid one has your D3. That's, um, 50% of your daily value of D3, your E 223% of your daily value of E that's an antioxidant. It, it helps to protect the cells from the damage caused from re free radicals, which we are getting from everywhere. Okay. We are getting damage from free radicals with the pollutants in our air, with the chemicals we're exposed to, with the processed food we eat, with everything, with stress, um, with not getting enough sleep, all that, it contributes to the free radicals. Antioxidants help fight that. So we need a lot of good antioxidants in our body. Um, it has the K2, 42% of your daily value that helps metabolize calcium. It is the main mineral found in your bones and teeth. You need that with your calcium and your vitamin D. It also has then a small essential oil blend in with that capsule that helps with um, mobility, liver function, and brain health. Um, it supports respiratory and immune systems. Uh, it helps support immune function and bioavailability. The bioavailability, that 86% bioavailability in one hour. Um, immune and digestive systems, immune function and bioavailability. So that capsule is the powerhouse there, helping it to get it into our cells. Okay, that's turmeric, cardamom, clove oil, fennel oil, and ginger oil. Hey, can anyone tell me? Fennel and ginger, what do they do too? Fennel and ginger are going to help with your digestive system. It's going to, and that's probably where the bioavailability is coming. They're helping that gut work right, and it's taking those minerals in. Okay. Um, then we're going to go down to those two capsules that are put together in there. Um, that is your wolfberry powder, your citrus bioflavonoids. Um, this, I don't know if anyone's familiar with organ B, which it's a blend of certified, certified organic guava, mango, and lemon extracts for a perfect synergy of B vitamins and chelated um, minerals. Okay. So it contains a hundred percent guys, a hundred percent of your natural vitamin B1, B2, B3, B5, B6, and B9. That is amazing. hundred percent of your B vitamin complex. Okay. Um, that helps critically with a range of normal body functions from cellular growth to metabolism. Um, vitamin B3 is also known as niacin helps with the metabolism of glucose and fat. Okay, we want more of that. Um, vitamin B6 is also known as pyridoxine, which dominates the metabolism of amino acids and lipids, brain health. Um, vitamin B9 is a coenzyme in the form of folates that aids in the production of red blood cells. Now, some people have this gene that has problems absorbing folic acid, but if you have your B9 in the, in the form of folate, your body can absorb that and it works. Um, my brother, Stephen has that gene missing. So he needs it in the form of folate versus folic acid. And he finds that a lot of things go wrong if you're not getting that folate instead of the folic acid. Okay. I know I have a handful of people in my family, either my husband's family or mine that are missing that gene and it causes problems when you don't have that. So that's a very important thing to have in the right form. Isn't this amazing science? I could talk supplements all day. Good thing. We got an hour. I gotta be on another call. Oh, in a half an hour. Okay. Um, so then we're going to <laughs> then the B12, it's 500 percent of your daily value of B12, which supports the blood production of red blood cells, guys. We want that if we're donating blood. Okay. Um, it also has your iron in there. Also good if you're donating blood. 56% of your uh iron. Um, your magnesium, that is very, very important also for your nerve function, blood sugar levels, blood pressure, um, zinc, selenium, copper, manganese, chromium, molybdenum, which removes toxins from the metabolism of sulfur containing amino acids. So like, I mean, just 
super awesome. All of these things, this is like a super multivitamin. Um, oh, so within there's, then they also have the other capsule. There's two of those. The other one has your Atlantic kelp, which is a rich source of iodine. We're not getting enough iodine in our, in our um, bodies. Now they did come out with the iodine based salt, but everyone's trying to say, hey, back off the salt. So now we're not getting your iodine anymore. So it's good to have a supplement. If you're not doing iodine, iodized salt, then it's important to have that iodine supplement. Um, the PABA, I'm not supposed, I'm not super up on what PABA is, but you see it in supplements, supports skin elect elasticity and joints, combats hair loss your spirulina algae, which is helps the blood lipids, blood sugar, and blood pressure, barley grass. These are like your green things. So I, um, I'm going to be talking about multigreens in a minute. This is like what's in the multigreens um, um, capsules too. So you wouldn't necessarily have to take multigreens and this because this is a lot of what's in multigreens. This great green stuff. We don't get a lot of those green vegetables. This is in there. Okay, moving on to the phytocaplet, that's going to have your vitamin C, 68% of your daily value of vitamin C supports your immune system, obviously, your calcium, now it only has 5% of your daily value of calcium, that's kind of low, isn't it? But the thing is, is we get quite a bit of calcium in our diets, but our body has a hard time absorbing it. So if you put the magnesium, the D3, and the K2 in your supplement and you're getting that and you're actually getting a lot of that bioavailability or the bioavailability is making it so you actually absorb a lot of that we're getting a lot more calcium than what we actually and that then if we would just take a calcium supplement without those things it's not doing us any good but a small amount of calcium with those other added things is actually doing for our bones what we need it to do okay they have had way more our artho or arthroporitic women nowadays than we used to, even though we're supplementing with a ton of calcium. And it's because that added calcium is not doing any good without the correct supplementation of other vitamins. Okay. Um, so potassium chloride, uh, chlorine, and then it's got the probiotics in there, the wolfberry fiber. So fiber, basically ways of getting fiber is your prebiotics, feeding those good bacteria and, um, Fructoglosaccharides, which is good food for the gut flora. Um, it also has a little bit of coffee fruit extract, which are antioxidants known to protect brain cells. But I do believe that's where the small amount of caffeine comes into play. Um, Jen, when I was listening to her, said that there's a small amount of caffeine in there. I don't know where it says how much caffeine. I don't think it's anything. It's not like a cup of coffee amount of caffeine, but there is a, I mean, if you're really sensitive to caffeine, that might be something to consider. Um, broccoli seed concentrate, um, onion bulb extract, apple fruit extract. So all these carrot root, cassia branch, blueberries, sweet cherry, blackberry fruit, choke cherry fruit, raspberry fruits, and all these things are extra C, K, A, E, folate, <laughs> antioxidants, vitamin C, potassium, folate, vitamin K. So all of these are, this is where you're going to juice those plants and herbs and dehydrate them and put them into a caplet form and get all those extra nutrients that you are not getting in your diet. So that's what that is all about. This is a full spectrum multi-nutrient complex providing premium vitamins, minerals, and food-based nutriment, nutriment, that is a word, to support general health and well-being. So the SSI technology which is the way that they deliver it in the three different forms, it makes up this synergistic complex to support your body. So the three, the way that they package those in three separate ways work together in your body to overall do even more than they could if they were all put together. So it's just really kind of amazing, um, amazing technology in a vitamin form. You're just gonna take one li liquid capsule, one caplet, and two capsules a day for all of those things. Okay. All right. Any questions about master formula? Whew. We are moving on to
multi greens. So I am waiting on my multi greens to come. I used the last one up on my trip to Rapid City this weekend, and I accidentally threw the bottle away without thinking. But they, so I can't show you the bottle, but they look like this. They're just little, like if you open them, it looks like green algae or, you know, I mean a powder, a green powder that's in there. Um, sorry. So this is great to take with Ningxia Red. Um, it's just good for general health support. It's rich in antioxidants. Um, it helps support memory, mood, other nervous system functions, which is why I take it because my memory is lacking. I blame it on night shifts. Um, it contains sea kelp, which is a great source of minerals. Um, it also has that high amount of iodine in it or a decent amount of iodine. Um, it also contains spirulina, which I mentioned from the multigreens. Um, it has a, a excellent source of bioavailable calcium, niacin, a, a B vitamin, potassium, magnesium, iron, and B vitamins. So if you're not taking, I don't know that I would necessarily take this with the master formula, but if you don't want to quite do all that's involved with the master formula, you, this is a great second choice. And this is so far the one I take right now. Um, it's only 4% of your daily value of iron. So just so that you know that it's not as high of a, an amount as the multigreens. It has bee pollen in it, which is just like amazingly healthy for you. Barley, grass, juice concentrate, spirulina, um, alfalfa, kelp, and then it's got rosemary oil, lemon oil, lemongrass oil, melissa oil in it that helps um, with the bioavailability part again. And an amino acid complex, which is the part that's good for your brain. There's three of these. I don't know if you are familiar with any of those. So the bee pollen are antioxidants. There's a source of minerals that an improves digestive function with the barley grass. The spirulina contains those um, B vitamins and iron. Um, alfalfa helps support healthy cholesterol and glucose levels. The kelp supports metabolism. Um, the, and so all of these things that the amino acid complex is going to support blood and circulation, um, metabolism, energy, nerve cell communication, and mood. So all of these things are just something greens that we just don't get a lot of. It kind of helps with that. It's great. It will, um, if you're not used to taking a lot of greens in your diet, it might make you gassy at first. Um, I haven't noticed any of that problem, but I do know a couple other people that told me that, um, that they started taking it and they started getting gas, but these are coming from people who don't eat vegetables, like raw vegetables at all. So I, that's why I figure that happens. You're supposed to take three capsules twice daily. If you have a really high metabolism, you can take four capsules twice daily. So it kind of depends. Um, I think, I think there's like a 30 day supply in there. Don't quote me on that because I don't know the bottle, but it's just, it is just an overall really good thing to take for your digestive health, for your memory, um, for your metabolism, for those antioxidants. It just has a lot of really great things. Nervous system function. Okay, any questions on multigreens? I'm gonna go to our life nine, which is our probiotic. Okay, everyone needs to be on a probiotic guys. Life nine, there it is. I know it's backwards. Okay, so life nine, the nine comes from the nine different kinds of probiotics that are in there, the nine different kinds of healthy bacteria, okay? And it has 17 billion live active cultures in each little capsule, okay? Now, it, when it comes to you, it is not refrigerated, and then you're supposed to put it in the refrigerator when you open it, because these are live active cultures. If you have anything that has live active cultures in it, you probably should put it in the fridge or they will keep growing and fermenting and not stay like where you want them. Um, you can break these apart and put them like in yogurt or something for kids, but um, I'm gonna talk about, the, we have a kid's probiotic that's actually better for doing that because this capsule is 
designed to dissolve at the exact right time in your body with the acid in your stomach to get to the right spot. And if you drop it into yogurt and take it, it's not going to get where it needs to go before it activates. Okay. Where the kids probiotic, which is, it tastes like a pixie stick. So this is amazing stuff. I, I had Sarah taking three packets a day over the weekend because she had some tummy trouble. And I tell you what, she never did throw up. It's called Mighty Pro. And you just rip it open and you can toss it back. And it's got the wolfberry powder and a little bit of the, um, what's it called? Erythritol and xylitol for a, just a slight little sweetened taste, but it doesn't taste like it's got a, a bunch of the sugar alcohols in it. I can't tell. I'm really sensitive to sugar alcohols and I can't tell with this, but um, it tastes good. The kids love it. They throw it back and they do. You can do this with meals because it has the prebiotic in it to help protect it until it gets to the right spot. Whereas the Life 9 does not have a prebiotic. It has the capsule encasing it that helps it get to the right spot. Does that make sense? So it is a little bit different with the timing of where you take this. You can take this with food. This one they want you to take before bed on kind of an empty stomach so that it, because it, it takes a while to get down to where it dissolves and is doing the work that it needs to do. Okay. Um, so it's anti-inflammatory. It breaks down waste. It aids the absorption of vitamins and minerals and improves immune response. It helps ease the IBS symptoms. It promotes a healthy gut, supports the immune system. Anything that helps your gut is going to support your immune system because 70% of your immune system is in your gut. Um, it helps by bad bacteria. It breaks down lactose. It's like milk products, right? Supports the immune and digestive systems, competes with other bacteria, breaks down foods that are considered non-digestible, ferments sugars, produces lactic and acetic acids, which help further break down other foods, produces natural antibiotics that kill bad bacteria. We need that, right? We don't want too much bad bacteria in our stomachs because that's when we start having problems. It supports immune function and digestion, the balance of the intestinal tract. So that's what all those nine different bacteria do, good bacteria. You want more good bacteria than you want bad bacteria. Um, there are no actual essential oils in this, but they still um, have it in that capsule that is supposed to be perfectly timed to get it where you need it. And if you take it on an empty stomach, either before bed or first thing in the morning, kind of and wait a little while before breakfast, either one of those things, it will get done what it needs to do. Now, you can't overdo probiotics. I mean, the worst that can happen is you might get a little loose with your bowel movements. Um, but basically, if you start feeling like you are getting sick, take extra probiotics and you're going to get that extra immune function uh, boost that you need to get better faster or maybe fend it off completely. So you could take even five or six right before bed if you're feeling like you're getting sick. Um, now, you don't want to be doing that like every day. That's like a once a month thing. <laughs> okay, but it's just like you want a really good boost to your immune system. You can take a whole bunch of these and, and, and buy a whole bunch of I mean, like five or six. And um, that will help get everything better. Because if you fix your gut, you fix a lot of other things too. Um, what is the daily? What is the daily recommendation for those? One a day. day, just one a day. Okay. One a day. Yep. And David loves this thing. I am not always very good at remembering to take it because it's in the fridge because you keep it in the fridge. So you have to kind of get in the habit of doing it or write yourself a note, but he is very good about doing this. And I tell you what, since he started doing the life nine, he takes the Ningxia red with the sulfur zyme and he does an inner defense in the morning. And those, that combination has really improved his he doesn't get sick like he used to. He used to get sick a lot more often. Um, if you take too many for too long, you will experience the diarrhea because your gut's being flushed out more than it needs to be, which makes sense, right? You're just getting that. Um, but when you are having one bowel movement per full meal per day, that's really the right consistency. You should be having three bowel movements a day not too soft, not hard, the nice formed snake. If you don't mind me getting a little into a picture here of what this looks like, 
Um, that's what it means when your gut is working correctly. And I'm a little behind. I need to up that, probably need to be doing this. Um, and we can record this and share it with Michelle. Okay. It says, take one capsule one to four hours after dinner on an empty stomach or as needed, refrigerate after opening. Any questions on that one? Uh, multigreens. Oh, and I forgot to mention that we also do have a kid's multivitamin too. It's not going to be as complete as the master formula, but it's a, just a cap, cap, a chewable capsule, caplet. No, what is the word I'm looking for? Tablet, a chewable tablet that they can take um, in the mornings. And then we're gonna talk about Ningxia Red. Did I miss one? Oh, I missed essential lines. So essential zymes, I'm gonna do essential zymes really quick and then we're going to go to Ningxia Red. So some essential zymes is your dietary enzymes. Now we have, yep, there, I'm just gonna talk about that too. Oh, there's Mighty Vites, good, thank you for showing Mighty Vites. We have we have four different adult dietary enzymes and one children's dietary enzyme. Now I will tell the story quick, Sarah. It, I, between the kids' probiotics and the kids' enzymes, we have very come very close to fixing her gut issues. I still think we probably need to try going gluten-free or dairy-free to see what happens. But we went from complaining every day to a stomach ache and having huge bloating issues to no complaints, no bloating, tummy looks normal with a probiotic once a day and an, a, one enzyme a day about, because she doesn't always take it, but we, we never even had to do three at, a, at the recommended dose for the kids is three enzymes a day. And we've only done it about twice a day and it was able to back down to once a day in order to just get her gut health under control. So she didn't need a ton, but she, it really made a huge difference. The enzymes are huge and why it's so important to have the enzymes is because our food is not easy to break down. Like it used to be again, back to the way that they're making it now. The, um, the, our immune system is more compromised. Our gut health is not as good. All of those things play into, we can't break down the lactose and it's got all the added stuff in it that it, it's not just plain milk. It's not just plain wheat. It's got extra stuff that our body doesn't know what to do with. So it's harder to break down. So we have different dietary enzymes. Essential zyme is the one that's kind of a great um, overall good for everyone type of a fit. Um, there are different ones like allerzyme that you can take if you have specific troubles taking certain foods, like if you have a sensitivity to gluten or sensitivity to, to lactose or milk products, you can take this with that and it kind of eases those symptoms. We also have detoxzyme, which can help kind of getting your gut detox. We took it with our cleanse last week to just kind of help flush everything out and also that good gut health, having those enzymes help flush things out. Um, and then we have the mighty zymes, which is, uh, the children's one. It's a chewable. And then also the one I don't have here tonight, because my husband has it at work is essential zymes four, which is kind of a little bit different than essential zymes, but we're just talking about just plain essential zymes today. Um, it, it has, okay, it's a good choice if you're looking for a broad spectrum digestive enzyme that also supports hormones. Now, I don't know too many women who don't need some kind of hormonal support. It is good for those who need help absorbing B12, calcium, iron, proteins, and essential zyme um, should be used by people who have low stomach acid. So if you have low stomach acid, this is the supplement for you. Um, it is the only enzyme supplement from Young Living that also contains something called betaine hydrochloric acid. 
uh, which promotes the production of hydrochloric acid, which is essential for high protein diets. So again, someone who has a high protein diet, low stomach acid, this would be a really good supplement for them. But it doesn't mean that it's not a good supplement for other people too. That's just a really targeted thing. Um, uh, it also has uh, lots of like the things that end in ASE, ACEs, you know, things that break down, you're, we're talking about enzymes here, things that break down food. So I don't, don't need to go into this a ton, um, but it helps the pancreas support. It helps, uh, produces other enzymes. It helps break down proteins. It helps with muscle growth and hormone production. It helps absorb uh, B12, calcium, iron proteins, helps the that stomach acid um, helps break down meats, dairy, eggs, grains, as well as seeds, nuts, leafy greens, and others. Helps supports the blood to help um, ease inflammation, helps support digestion. Um, so all of those things, it's a bilayered multi, multi enzyme complex caplet specifically formulated to support and balance digestive health to stimulate overall enzyme activity to combat the modern diet. Um, it also has tarragon, peppermint, anise, fennel, and clove essential oils to help with that bioavailability and also help the digestive system do its job better, okay? So I, I would think too that diabetics would be, um, also people who have had their gallbladder out, this is a huge one. Any of the dietary enzymes are big, for people who have had their gallbladder out because they have trouble absorbing those fatty things um, and the proteins. And people who have uh, pancreas, you know, like a struggle with pancreatitis, I bet this would be awesome for them too, okay? And if you want to know more about the different enzymes we have and what are the best ones for you, I can totally try and troubleshoot a way to figure that out. Okay, then we're gonna move right along to Ning Red because I'm almost out of time. Um, Ning Shred, a favorite of mine. Good stuff. Mom, are you noticing anything with this yet? No. You've been through one bottle. I wonder if- I, Yeah, I'm almost done with the second. You're almost done with the second. So I'll be interested to see what happens when you run out. If you notice like a dip in energy or um, create more cravings, because I know that we've been kind of struggling. We've been on the sugar bus and trying to get out back off the sugar bus, you know, this last month. So I'm, I'm wondering if it's going to, if you're going to notice more that you don't have it than if, when you did have it. Cause for me, that's what happens to me when I really get on a good routine. I don't really notice any difference, but then I get off of it and I'm like, Oh, I feel so sluggish today. Oh, just feel like eating all day. <laughs> What's wrong with me. <laughs> so that's, it's like one of those things where you don't notice until it's not there anymore. Um, so Ningxia, powerhouse of antioxidants. Again, I cannot stress enough how much we need antioxidants. Um, the whole family can benefit from this. Um, I've been trying to get my dad to take it too, because he's having some eye problems. This is so, so good for your eyes. I mean, tons of testimonies where people had some really strong eye trouble, took Ningxia religiously and maybe slightly higher than normal amounts and went back to the eye doctor and the eye doctor's like, what on earth did you do? <laughs> you have had a huge improvement here. So it's just really, really good for your eyes. It's and that antioxidants, it's going to help your eyes. It's going to help your skin. It's going to help your brain. All of those things are beneficial with antioxidants. So the wolf berry is also known as the goji berry. Um, it's one of the highest found antioxidants fruits out there. Um, a daily shot helps support better energy, normal cellular function, whole body wellness and health. Um, four ounces of Ningxia equals one serving of fruit, but one ounce has the antioxidant equivalent to eating four pounds of carrots or eight whole oranges. Hmm. So I, does anyone want to raise their hand here the last time they sat and ate four pounds of carrots in one sitting? Okay, I didn't think so. Um, it is safe for all people from solid food eating children to adults, pregnant and nursing women should also consider using Ningxia. We, I've had, I don't know how many testimonials of pregnant women who took it that their doctor said, oh my word, what did you do during your pregnancy? And the, the pregnant lady's like, why? Just because this is the healthiest placenta I've ever seen. 
I mean, super good for things that you don't even realize are going on. Um, it has the orange, the yuzu, the lemon, and the tangerine essential oils in Ningxia Red, which contain the D-limonene, powerful wellness promoting constituent. It is free of high fructose sweeteners. Um, it's got exotic fruits such as the blueberry, the cherry, the aronia, the pomegranate, and plum, which helps give it that delicious flavor. Um, they also do have just dried Ningxia or goji berries that you can get from Young Living. But I tell you what you have, I mean, like my husband's already kind of on the loose side of the bowel movement section and he has like a handful of those and he's running to the bathroom. So if you need something to clear you out, you might want to invest in some dried wolf berries. <laughs> um, it only has 25 calories per serving. It's got five grams of natural sugars. There's no added sugars there. Um, it's got a little bit of protein in there. And actually for the amount, it doesn't, you know, less than one gram of protein doesn't sound like much, but the protein to carb to fat balance. Okay. If you know anything about diabetic health, guys, my brother, Philip's a diabetic. We've talked about this, the balance of carb to fat to protein are a, like a perfect fit for diabetics. It actually, the way that they work together lowers the blood sugar overall, even though it's a fruit juice and you think fruit juice, it's gonna take that blood sugar up this way. It actually, diabetics find that when they drink this regularly, they tend to have lower blood sugars than if they weren't because it balances out that metabolism and that amazing balance there. Um, and they use the whole fruit puree. So uh, normally you get juice from the store. What is it? It's from concentrate. Okay. It's not the pureed goodness. If you, the reason that juicing is so good is because you're getting so much the nutrients and not just the juice. It's from the pulp of the, the fruit. And that's why they, they try and do the whole fruit puree. And it's not like thick, like high pulp orange juice or anything like that. It's thicker than juice juice. And it's not like, it's not see-through, but it, you can tell that it has substance without being like a real thick texture. Okay. Um, it also does have the aronia fruit juice concentrate, um, sweet cherry fruit juice concentrate, plum juice concentrate, blueberry fruit ju juice concentrate, and pomegranate fruit juice concentrate. But don't think of concentrate like you get that at the apple juice junk from the store. It's not the same thing. This is very, very pure ingredients. Um, it also has orange yuzu lemon tangerine oils that helps with the bioavailability the ningxia berry itself helps a ton with bioavailability of everything else so if you're taking ningxia with your master formula you're upping your bioavailability more you take it with your sulfur zyme, you're upping your bioavailability ningxia is amazing those antioxidants help get those minerals and vitamins into your cells okay um what else it has pure vanilla extract in it it has calcium, iron, sodium, potassium. Um, people that have trouble with your iron being high enough giving blood, I've heard that if you take this every day, you will not have trouble with that at the blood drive. And I do, if I take it regularly, I don't go in lower than I have to be when I'm giving blood. And I, ne I typically am low, too low to give blood. But if I'm taking my nature regularly, I'm up above that threshold. So it does help, just that one difference. Okay. The puree is rich in vitamins and minerals, including A and C. So if you're taking that, you're boosting that A and C vitamins with your zinc and your iron. Um, this is unusually high in complex carbohydrates. So normally you think, oh, carbs are bad. Complex carbohydrates can be good for you if they're the right kind of carbohydrates. You don't want the simple carbohydrates because so it's just straight sugar, right? Um, it supports the immune system and has been found particularly beneficial to support liver and eye health. Um, and the collection of all the juices that are in there, all extremely high antioxidant rich fruit juices that are known to support immune function and protect against that oxidative stress. Um, I just want to say that it includes support for energy levels, normal, normal cellular function, whole body and normal eye health. And a daily shot of two to four ounces helps support overall wellness with powerful antioxidants. Um, 
it has one of the highest percentages of fiber of any whole food. And it contains, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to pronounce this, um, zeaxophen, a carotenoid, which carotenoid, you might think a biocarotene, something that has to do with your eye health, okay? Important to maintaining healthy vision. It also contains polysaccharides, amino acids, good for your brain. Um, symbiotic vitamin mineral pairs that when present together provide, promote optimum internal absorption. By using whole wolf, wolfberry puree, the juice, the peel, the seeds, and the fruit, they are able to maintain more of the desired health supporting benefits in every bottle of Minxurette. Okay, now you can get it by the bottle or you can get it with these two ounce packets. I do recommend the two ounce packets if you live in a cold region and you would be nervous that it might freeze in the bottles uh, in shipping. Um, I did not have much trouble with that this year. I had a couple people that it said froze, but it did not break the bottle. So they were kind of gambling there a little bit, but um, that is just something that we order every single month. I sometimes get the kids to get, take it. And sometimes, I mean, they take it, they love to take it, but I just don't always remember. So I try and at least remember to give them an ounce in the morning, but sometimes I don't remember, sometimes I don't. Um, it does support their immune function as well as other things too. I'd like to do an experiment because my son's been, my oldest son's been, um, his eyes changed just a little bit, not enough to get glasses this last time, but I would love to boost him up on his nature and see what his next eye visit is. So anyway, any questions? These are the five most um, recommended supplements for good reason. I also want to just do a shout out for the Sulfurzyme. That's an MSN supplement. If you're familiar with MSN and glucosamine chondroitin, it's usually used for joint health, but ours is a much higher concentration of MSN. And not only does it help the joints, um, but it helps with your skin and your hair and your energy levels and your brain function and your gut health. And it kind of just does a little bit of everything. You stick it with Ningxia Red and it's kind of a powerhouse combo. And that is seriously one of the biggest testimonials I hear after I've joined Young Living, like everyone who does monthly um, ordering from Young Living gets those two things because they notice amazing things after being on them for a while. And maybe if you don't notice it right away, you notice it when it goes away. You, know, you mom did notice when you took sulfazyme away, didn't you? You could really help. You could tell how that was supporting your joints, but the two together are kind of like a synergistic combo and really make a difference. So I will be interested to see what happens when you run out of Ningxia. Um, okay. If you have any questions on any of these supplements, if I can get you some more literature, um, if I can help you to get an account, we do have a monthly subscription program. It's very easy. Like you can do it one month and not do it the other. There's no penalties. There's no, you can earn points with your purchases, depending on how much you're ordering. Um, and it's just super easy. There's no strings attached type of thing, but I really feel like, um, you, if you're like ordering your master formula, I think like every fourth or fifth month, you can get a free one because of the points you're accumulating just by ordering that. So we have to kind of figure out the math there, but it can really pay for itself. If you're ordering things consistently, any way that you want to be doing for your health, it helps you afford those more. Okay. So I think I'm going to go ahead and if there's no questions, I'm going to go ahead and end because I'm supposed to speak at another Zoom meeting at eight <laughs> about hormone health. Someone asked me to do that last minute. And um, so I'm going to go do that and maybe get my kids tucked into bed in between. But thank you so much for taking the time. I'm sorry for the confusion with everything. I did struggle a little bit with the Facebook live thing. I'm not going to do that again. I don't have a good enough connection. So anyway, thank you You're for your time. What? Thank you. Yes. We're going to fix that so you can do it again. Yes. Yes. Um, I, if my husband's here, he's still at work because he had a really bad day, but if he's here, he can do his hotspot, but I have not figured out how to do the hotspot with my phone. So then we have good internet. So anyway, thank you guys. Have a great night. I will, I get this uploaded to my computer and I can post it later. Okay. All right. Thank you. Have a good night. Bye, thank you.